Howdy, 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 my beautiful Capricorn. How are you doing, darling? My name is Simply Velka Capricorn, and today I'm going to be getting into your weekly tarot reading for the month of July 2022, darling Capricorn, all right? So if you enjoy this tarot reading here today, let me know in the comments below, Capricorn, how this tarot reading resonates, all right? That's how I keep up with y'all, is through the comments below. And be sure, Capricorn, if you haven't already, give this video a like and subscribe, darling. What are you doing? It's completely free to do, and it uh, helps out this tarot reading channel a lot, Capricorn, all right? Um, be sure as well, darling, when it comes to getting tarot readings for your zodiac sign be sure to cater to the energy to your chart check out your sun moon rising and venus sign capricorn all right that's how you get the full spectrum uh when it comes to receiving uh general tarot readings on youtube darling all right so capricorn we're going to be getting into three rows for you your first row is going to be in regards to your financial situation as well as career all right your second row capricorn is going to be in regards to your social life this could be your platonic life your romantic life this could be your next friend family it's your social life honey you know your social relationships all right capricorn and then in your third and final row capricorn we're going to be getting into just some general messages that y'all need to be hearing at this time how's that sound cappy all right so let's just get right into this tarot reading here for you today dialing but starting this energy out all right we have the back of the deck energy here being the seven of swords here darling all right capricorn so first message i want to be telling you guys here is just do not do not be afraid of asking for help here i feel like some of you capricorns are just taking on so much on your own all right and it's like you don't want to rely on anyone else you don't want to ask anyone else for fear or disappointment in them what it is that they would say and you'd rather just do things on your own on your own terms here but i also want you to think bigger uh capricorn all right some of you guys always will speak and connect with god you'll speak with god you'll speak with your spiritual team archangels whatever you subscribe to it's not my business capricorn all right you'll connect to these otherworldly beings but you are being too humble or maybe too prideful and asking for help from them all right and so that's what i want to be saying is just like loosen up your burden some all right also here's a message as well capricorn all right there is just something that i want to be um giving you a heads up on here all right i feel like it's going to come out later in the reading here but make sure that you are protected honey all right keep some black tourmaline on you keep an evil eye on you just keep yourself protected all right taking a look in regards to your social life here i mean not your social life your career situation you have the nine of cups seven as well as ace of wands stepping forward to you capricorn all right pretty positive cards here i would be saying for you capricorn this is a pretty solid week when it comes to um people i feel as if you're going to be getting along with people that you normally wouldn't get along with in the work environment here i want to be saying as well capricorn i wouldn't be surprised as you continue pursuing what it is that you want to do you just be this is what i was talking about beforehand just like just be aware about people who secretly wish they were doing what you're doing capricorn <laughs> that's what i get it's like you are you start sharing this idea where it's just like oh i want to do social media like whatever it is for you capricorn it's like you share these ideas and you start taking action towards it i just get like the sense of where it's just like it bothers certain people that you're doing that all right whether it's like it's because it's not in their belief system they don't understand they're scared they don't like taking risks or something like that it's like someone wants to poo poo on your parade all right and so just be careful about who you share your new nair uh, hello why can't i speak just be careful capricorn about who you share your news to who you share like what you want to do with because of just yeah because you don't know everyone's intentions darling now in regards to your social life here capricorn we have the two of cups hermit energy with the knight of pentacles here this seems pretty solid for you capricorn all right i feel like for current relationships here this is the sense of where you're going to be seeing better developments when it comes to some social life, social situation in your life here all right so where it's just like maybe you haven't been hearing back from a family member or maybe a friend or a loved one um capricorn for a while now i feel like you're going to be hearing some news from them they're, go they're going to be slowly coming out of their shell in the coming days here so if you have been no contact with somebody for a little bit capricorn be expecting them to come out of their shell here for others of you capricorns i see you actually as the hermit card where it's just like once you slowly start getting out of your shell uh capricorn you're going to be pleasantly surprised by like who welcomes you once you get out of your shell here this knight of pentacles is a court card with this two of cups here you cannot neglect the message of a potential either fellow earth sign or somebody that really relates to you a lot so, like there's something that uh, uh is like a magnet to both y'all's energies so whether you guys 
guys relate to have a lot of similarities personality wise or something there's something there's a common bond that keeps y'all uh connected in some way here all right so be anticipating for those coming out of their shell capricorn of a pretty solid connection here all right slow burn a slow burn kind of relationship you know again whatever kind of relationship that is but overall pretty pleasant here now for your general messages coming in here at capricorn all right you have the death card coming in page of pentacles with the eight of cups stepping forward here <sighs> okay darling okay capricorn this is a direct message for some of you guys here where it's just like you are emotionally distant towards somebody i feel like you made the choice to disconnect yourself a little bit here where it's like you were not the one that was always reaching out anymore when it comes to certain relationships in your life you were just done being like always being the one to have the sense of responsibility reaching out to them you were just done with some relationship where i don't know i get like the sense where it's just like some relationship or relationships for some of you capricorns were just very underwhelming for you where you started distancing yourself from it where you're just like you know it wasn't it wasn't giving what it needed to give in your life and um at the time capricorn and so you're just starting to start distance for yourself from it there why that setup is coming in here we'll know with the clarifiers in a little bit but firstly let's clarify your career and your uh, financial situation capricorn remembering that it's the ace as well as seven of wands with that nine of cups coming in here the higher or not the higher pinch the five of cups and wands coming in your yeah cups and wands coming in with the king of wands as well <clears throat> back of the deck is the chariot energy here now for you capricorn there is this sense of where something some type of upset or some type of um initial conflict that happens some type of uh obstacle on your road that happens it, there is this sense for you capricorn where it's just like making lemons out of lemonade i use this quote for somebody for their monthly tarot reading it might have been for you capricorn but it is like this message of making lemons out of lemonade where it's just like one man's rejection is god's redirection or something like that that's kind of how i feel like it is for you some of you capricorns are probably starting to feel a little bit fed up when it comes to your uh career situation here maybe some of you guys are starting to use your voice be a little bit more demanding about what it is that you wanted to be how you want to be treated in the workplace here all right some of you guys are using your voice a little bit more to take care of some problems here it's like i get like the sense of you guys you capricorn are starting to take a lot of just like solid physical action towards whatever the obstacle is all right some and i feel like you guys are going to be making a lot of forward ground here but it is just like this sense of just really transmuting a negative situation or a frustrating situation capricorn and making it very profitable all right so let's clarify now your social life here with that nine or not not, not that nine darling Cappy. uh with the hermit energy the two of cups as well as that knight of pentacles darling all right cherry card coming right back out with the three of wands here and then the four of cups coming in here three of pentacles in the back of the deck here capricorn all right i do feel greatly for many of you capricorns this is giving me a sense where there's like a relationship that you guys need to pay attention to all right there's a relationship that you need to be paying attention to all right because i feel like you guys are being a little bit recluse right now not wanting to get out of your shell here and that's a missed opportunity you guys are receiving signs right now maybe there's just been it's like maybe you've been thinking about certain people or certain thoughts that remind you of people have been coming up it's happening for a reason pay attention to reminders this week about certain people capricorn because your spiritual team is trying to draw attention to them for a reason some of you guys probably even as i'm speaking already have like two people that have come to mind perhaps capricorn of like what it is that it is about but like for some reason spirit is really trying to put a focus in or a sense of awareness for you capricorn about a relationship that they don't want you to be neglecting all right as well for some of you capricorns all right as well for some of you capricorns be prepared to have some type of relationship in your life to start acting different now when i say different not in like a bad way capricorn 
all right not in like a bad way but it's just like someone that you normally would aren't that close to taking efforts capricorn to get to know you more all right i get like the sense of like people starting to get a little bit more comfortable to be forward with you and speaking like their truth a little bit more like revealing their feel like not revealing their feelings that sounds a little bit more soap opery than what i would like but i just get like the sense of like a lot of people are going to be coming to you this week tour uh not taurus capricorn with like information that you wouldn't normally anticipate all right <clears throat> And now getting into your general messages here, let's clarify that death energy with the page of pentacles as well as that. What was that third card, darling? That eight of cups, Capricorn. What is this about? Girl, your cards. Nine of wands here, the star energy with the queen of wands here. Oh, darling, Capricorn. There's someone in your life that needed, maybe this was you. But this speaks about a story of this individual who needed to experience life a little bit, who needed to be on, be on a journey of themselves for a little bit, to do a little bit of a soul seeking, a little bit of exploring where it's just, just themselves and their own thoughts following in their passion here, all right? And it's like by this person following in their passion there, it's like they needed that time alone and then they're going to be coming back to you. All right. If there's someone that you lost in your life, not like an actual death, darling, but someone that you wish that the relationship continued on for, darling to, uh, Capricorn, um, just know that it's not the end. They will come back to you. All right. For others of you, Capricorn, this is your story, darling. This is, your, you know, calling you out back out on that hermit energy. This is you coming out of your shell again, following in that passionate pursuit, queen of wands knight of wands letting the world know that i'm capricorn i am still here standing here and you're chasing after your dream the star card energy here this is a direct message of just not giving up darling all right keep strong with what it is that you are doing have that keep uh, you know reinforce that conviction that you have darling all right because you will get to your destination even though you are feeling really weak right now feeling fatigue you feel like giving up darling keep on pushing through darling all right my beautiful capricorn so let's wrap up your tarot reading for this week darling with an animal oracle card as well as a moon oracle card shark card coming in here for you all right capricorn trust your instincts to discern the truth of a situation here trust your instincts to discern your, the truth in a situation here this goes back to what i was saying at the beginning tour uh, why do we want to keep calling you taurus capricorn all right i don't understand that maybe it's just human mistake but my gosh this happens so often but as was, uh, i was saying capricorn it's like it goes back to the beginning of this reading where it's just like just be careful about who you share your good news to all right there's sharks in the water darling and just like even though those sharks are docile right docile right now doesn't mean those sharks are always going to forever be docile so just keep yourself protected all right keep yourself protected all right spirit really wants to have that message be heard for you and then your full moon darling capricorn okay the end of a tough cycle is approaching for you darling all right the card says it here itself here so you know i'm not just saying it's just to say it capricorn all right take a deep breath that's what we were just talking about darling all right you know keep on pushing through get out of your shell you know take away the blackout curtains when's the last time that you went out for a walk here all right some of you guys it's just like a reminder not to get too you know trying to get you out of that spiral get you out of that depressive rut honey all right but before you get too deep in there it's never too late to pull yourself back out to darling speaking from many years of experience <laughs> capricorn but um capricorn that's the weekly tarot reading that i have for you darling all right hopefully this tarot reading resonated if it did be sure to check out your monthly tarot reading all right as well as give this video a like and subscribe capricorn if you want to book a private reading with me my website's linked down below simply velka Dot com next to my social media is tiktok and instagram capricorn as well just being simply velka same as here but um i love you so much darling capricorn and hopefully i can connect with you sometime in the near future bye darling